Hey people, Zarthwomp here, and welcome to episode 10 of Donkey Kong 64. Last time, we entered the third world in the game, Frantic Factory, where we saved Chunky. And now we are going to continue moving through the world, pulling levers and springing on spring pads. Anyways, let's go. We got a can mini game that we can do in this world, so let's go. Okay. Well, looks look what I'm doing again. Into the void, donkey. Into the void. Okay. Once again, we're doing this because I want to get as many bananas as I can. There are plenty of bananas in this area. There's at least 10. Okay. I will not give up. The bananas will not defeat me. There. Anyways, you actually want to aim for that ring. But for our purposes, we want the banana. Anyways, if you don't hit that ring, you'll just keep going around and around in a circle until you actually do. Anyways, boom. And that will produce a lever in front of a Donkey Kong arcade machine. We're going to need that for later. But for the time being, well, let's go do some things. Okay, first off, we have some stuff that Tiny can do. So let's whip out Tiny and just, well, get her blueprint. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to go back to that one area until, basically, we get Chunky's punch attack. So that way we can do some stuff with him. Yeah, but as you can see, just Chunky. Very active moveset. Okay, Tiny. Yes, we are fulfilling Chunky's wishes and we are sacrificing the girl. Okay. Let's go. Okay. This attack is very handy, really. Just thank you, banana fairies. Okay. Let's go up here. As you can see, just Tiny has a very fast climbing speed. Okay. This is a Diddy area, so we'll go back for Diddy. Okay. Thankfully, that warp barrel is relatively easy to access. Okay, so we got two of the blueprints. That's pretty much just one banana established for both of them. <coughs> Sorry. Okay. Diddy time. Okay. Yeah, if only we had a technique like the Talon Trot to easily run through this level. Okay. Let's go. Run, run, run. Yeah, we can't do anything with that gate just yet, but we will. Don't you worry. Okay. Let's go over here and that arcade machine that we were that we saw earlier. Right here. Come on. Okay. And a tag barrel. Okay. Yeah, there's Tiny right there. Where's the Tiny Pad at, Curiosity? Oh, I think we actually have to make the Tiny Pad up here. I'm not 100% certain. But anyways. Nope, that is the Tiny Barrel. Okay, anyways. I thought that was a Tag Barrel. Thankfully, they always include a Tag Barrel right in the boss area, so... Donkey time! Anyways, out of curiosity, you like the original Donkey Kong game? Well, we get to play it right here. First use of the lever. And 
Welcome, this game is required, and we actually have to do this golden banana to beat the game, believe it or not. How high can you get? Okay, I'm gonna be honest with ya. I stink at Donkey Kong, uh, the original Donkey Kong. So anyways. Let's go. Okay. Boom. I know. Ah. Hey, you know what? I'll try it again. I'll basically try it legit. And if I fail, I'll basically just restart from the game. Actually, no. You have to... You have to actually pull the lever every time. So, yeah. Every time I die, I'll just go back and do this. Okay, come on. Okay. I know. I'm the barrels! They confuse me! I told you I suck at this game. I'm sorry. It's just in my way. Okay. This watch out. This is gonna be the harsh challenge. I'm sorry. I'm too used to modern platforming. Ah! I'm too used to basically hit and run tactics, where basically I can run and I can jump. I play too many modern platformers, where basically that is a viable strategy. Meanwhile, in old time games like this, it was, oh, you're fighting the game. You are fighting with the best of your abilities. Okay. Nice. And, no, there. There we are, Pauline. Okay, save. I know this is cheap. I know it's cheap, but darn it, I will do this. Why are there pies? Why are we in a factory? What type of standards of work is in here? And why do these pies kill Mario? Okay, welcome to the 75M stage, the classic Smash Bros stage. Right? Be cheap, embrace the cheap. Darn, the game's gonna be cheap to me, I'll be cheap to the game. That's what I mean. Look at that. Just Mario dies by touching the foot of Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong's not even moving. But then again, just that's how powerful Cranky is. You don't mess with Cranky. Cranky's gonna attack you with the power of Lumpego. Mario dies from height. As well. So yeah. Not a fun time. There's no music. There is no fun. This game feels that you are done. Okay. No! Why are there springs? Yeah, Cranky's weapon. I got the springs, mother effer! Don't make me throw a spring at you! I have poison pies and springs! Okay. No! Mario, why do you move so slow? Okay. Let's 
go. Okay. Go, go, go. Thank you. Oh! The springs have relentlessness. Okay, once I get up there, I'm going to just create another restore point. Just that spring. Just that spring. What? What killed me there? I just jumped! I jumped! That was my crime! I jumped! And... What is with the momentum? I swear, I, I mean, I don't mean to rib on the original Donkey Kong. It is a classic in video game heritage, and I do respect it, I really do. But basically, but at times the mechanics can be just absolutely janky, I'm sorry. Especially in this game. Okay. There we go. Great restore point. Okay. Nope, restore. Okay. Load. Okay. Yes! And we have a one-up. How I can you get? Great. Okay. Okay. Reset, load, load. No, do not touch me. Yeah, Pac Man, mother ever. Back, I have a hammer. Okay, go, 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 and... Okay! I have to do this! Ass! Okay, I have to do it. It is classic. Okay, one. Squawk, now you've warmed up. How about trying to win a unique special prize by completing it again? Just two coins to play. Okay, and you have to do this. There is no if, and, or but. You have to play Donkey Kong twice. Because Donkey Kong has a Nintendo coin. 
A lead has been replaced by a coin. But I am a cheap, I am cheap. And I will do this, and I will be cheap. I'm just making things more convenient for myself. I... Re redo. Hey, basically, I could do it the legit way that basically entails having to just slog through, you die. You die, you basically have to restart. Okay. I know. Okay. Hello! Load, redo, redo. Okay. Come on, bring it. How can it climb a broken ladder? Okay. Space them out in just such a way that it would destroy me. Okay, redo. I don't care if this is cheap. This is making things more convenient. The key to defeating games like this. You just gotta be patient. No, okay. I can eventually get through it. And get crushed by a barrel. Okay. Ah. Come on, bring it! Boom! Okay. The barrels have no mercy. The barrels have no rules. The barrels will come out for you. They will destroy. They will eviscerate. They will not stop until you are annihilated. Okay. Go. And I was greedy. I was a greedy man. Okay. Let's try this again, shall we? This time we won't go for the hammer. Instead, just focusing on a beeline. And okay, I'm getting the hammer whether I want it or not. Only if, if only this was like the Mario and Donkey Kong games, where you could just throw the hammer up and do a bunch of somersaults. Okay, no. Ah! Okay, I may just want to do it halfway. You, yeah, and you have to play the entire game. And this is required to actually beat this game. You want to get the basic ending of this game? Guess what you're dealing with? You're dealing with the with Donkey Kong Kaizo. Okay. Yeah, because you need that Nintendo 64 coin. And yeah, that one extra life is nothing. I'm sorry it is. It's just it feels like nothing. And that, that was all me. I was looking up at this thing to see if I had an extra life, but apparently I don't. Or maybe that two is a life. L2. The 
rhythm. The freaking rhythm. It would be nice if basically you knew, okay, these barrels operate on this logic. But then it just said, no, the barrels operate on whatever logic they want to operate under. Doing a beeline dash is the best way to get through the levels. Okay. I was trying. I was trying. Okay. Okay. Thankfully, things get a little tamer once you actually get through this one. There! Finally, RNG was on my side, and Mario is in love with the coin. Mario has fallen in love with the coin. Mario has spent too much time on the internet, and so he's fallen in love with the coin. Okay, we are creating a restore point, because darn it, I am not going to lose this game. Thankfully, you only have to pay the coins once, the flat fee. So if you get a game over, it's not like, oh, you gotta pay five coins every time. Yeah, that's right. Now we have it where the conveyor belts are moving to and fro. Okay, and... Okay, great. This is why you create the restore point. You want to be on the safe side. I just jumped slightly down! I just jumped slightly down and it just utterly wrecked us! Oh, I'm sorry, Mar- I'm sorry, jump man, if you had to actually jump! Okay, great! Okay, good. Create. I have no shame at this moment. I will do what needs to be done. Yay! Okay, next level. Okay, create. Okay, let's go. Okay. Load. Okay. Okay, go, 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 go. Go, go, go. And Mario dies. There is no saving, Grace. There is nothing. You get no mercy. Mercy is for the weak. What even are these fire creatures? I don't even know. They just appear out of nowhere. As if Donkey Kong is summon the as if Cranky could summon the forces of hell. Is this why Cranky is so overconfident? He knows that he can summon the forces of hell to absolutely wreck his enemies. That 
That's right, Donkey. I know the powers of the demonic arts. I will summon the devils of the demons of hell to take on the Kremlin army, Donkey. Okay, and whoopee. Thank you, loud iPad tone. Okay, go, go. What the? What even is that? Is, is that like a springy barrier or what? Okay. No. There is no rhyme or reason to these fire demons. Cranky's armies from hell have nothing. Okay. No. Yes. And now Mario may have his godless love with this coin. Okay. Hmm, what to do? I'll just be nice about it. I'll basically just put something along the lines of L O L. Okay. And. And now we have the N64 coin. We have the N64 coin, the Nintendo coin. No, I don't want to play. No. I don't want this. Well, it looks like the game thinks I want this. Oh no, that means level three. I'm not doing level three. If I die here at level three, this is where I die. Why do I somehow manage to do it perfectly? 100% perfect. Level three, no deaths. It's gonna happen. I'm gonna do this somehow. First try. Okay. Donkey has, has ended the run. Game over. Okay. Anyways, I think now would be a good time to end things off. Anyways, I really appreciate that you stuck around to watch this episode. You're a great viewer, and I hope you come back for the next one. If you like this video, like, subscribe, comment, share, do whatever you want. And I'll see you next time. Bye.